Hey all you BlackBerry users, Todd here from NiceBlackBerry.com. Today I'm going to demo a new release that we've uh, just pushed out. It's called 6.1. Um, this is a, uh, it's a three-in-one theme. You basically can get what you see here, a Zen. You can have a Zen, you can basically have Zen style, bottom dock icons, or you can have a today style, uh, like standard today style, or you can have a hidden today. Um, so it's up to you. The Today Style has a smaller font. The Hidden Today has a larger font. I'm going to demo this on our uh, 9800 Torch running OS 6. This is available for all devices running OS 4.6, 4.7, 5.0, and OS 6. Um, so go to our website, niceblackberry.com, and you can uh, locate your device, see screenshots, read the description, uh, check out the demo video, and purchase and purchase it. So let's do this. Uh, let's demo this here. Let's show you what you get. Um, first, you can see I'm hovered over top of profiles. Um, if I go off of profiles and back, you get the name of the app um, as you hover over top of it. Um, then uh, in the top banner, you've got clock. You've got access to your universal search, and you've got access to your managed connections. Um, so that's what you get in the top banner. From there, you can go down to the bottom dock where on the torch uh, and the storm, on the 9800 torch and the 9500 storm, you have 10 icons down here that you can arrange in any order that you want. Um, so as you can see, let me zoom in a little bit closer. Um, all the icons are the new OS 6, uh, OS 6.1 icons. They've been reworked to fit the device properly. The one icon, because of the updating calendar, we did leave that um, as what you have on your device. So, um, But all the other icons are the same. So that's what you get. Let's go into the main menu and we'll show you again. Here's a close-up of all of these icons. The text message icon, uh, memo pad icon, phone. You can see that. And then all the third-party apps, obviously, they have their own icons. So, um, so that's what you get there. Uh, to activate the standard today style, go ahead and flip up the keypad and hit Alt-T. That's going to pop up your standard today style where you get uh, messages and calendar. On the torch and on the, uh, the 9800 torch and the 9500 storm, you get three messages and four calendar entries that you can preview there. Um, from there, you can go and hover over top of any of these um, to you know go in and read them, review them, whatever. You can, uh, your calendar, you can click on an individual appointment like so and you can go back. Um, and uh, and you can change it or anything you want. So that's what you get there. Um, so that is with uh, that is with just the standard today style. Um, then what you can do if you want, you can turn on a hidden today preview. And how you do that is on the keypad Alt Y. And what that's going to do is give you a hidden today preview um, with a bit of a bigger font. So let's go down on top of calendar and we'll show you. Um, so right there, this is what your hidden today preview looks like um, hover over top of any of the activating icons and it will show um, it will show what you have calendar is one of them um, memo pad on OS 6 you get memo pad you can view your missed phone calls uh, you can also view task um, and then I, I, if you put your message icon up there you can get um, messages you can view your incoming emails um, so that's basically how it works it gives you a little larger font because you can go across the whole screen so that's why we use the hidden today for the larger font um, so and then if you don't want any today style at all you can go alt on the keypad go alt f which is off and what that's going to do is return you to your standard today um, your standard uh, not today but your standard zen style where you don't get any preview as you can see if I hover over top of calendar no previews pop up um, so that's what that is uh, one thing to mention before I forget also when you are in the hidden today preview you get a little icon up here it's an it's like a couple piece of paper kind of and it says HT that shows you your hidden today is activated um, so you don't accidentally forget that it's activated walk away from your desk um, and someone can come see what you got so just alt F turns either the uh, alt F will turn off the today screen or it will turn off your hidden today screen. So that's what you get there. Also, Alt S is going to open up your um, search, and you can basically universal search. Let's say if I type in Z I M P L I F I E R, uh, that will, if you have it set up to search App World, it'll search App World. You can click it, and I just got a new version, so let's hope it'll work. Here you go. Um, basically, it's going to open up App World, and it's going to show you everything that we have uh, in App World for sale. So um, that's what you get there. 
um, escape back and you can go uh, you can go to your home screen um, in uh, landscape mode landscape mode basically what you get is you get 10 icon or you get eight icons down here so eight icons no hidden today or anything this is just an icon screen uh, but you get eight icons and then you also have access to clock uh, search and manage connections as well as profiles um, so that's what you get there um, click back over into here um, we'll go in it's wallpaper friendly so let's real quick like go down let's go into media um, there's your there's you can see some new icons here new picture icon and stuff podcast all that so um, they are all OS 6.1 uh, icons so let's go down to wallpaper and let's grab a wallpaper to set um, we'll go ahead and set this wallpaper right here. Hit the menu, set as wallpaper. Let me go back to the home screen, and there's your wallpaper set. Um, so this is wallpaper set in Zen mode. If I open up the keypad, I can go Alt T. Here's your today. Uh, here's your today screen with messages and um, calendar. If you need, if you're using a real light wallpaper and you need an extra backdrop, just hit the space key. That's going to open up uh, kind of an opaque backdrop, which. Uh, makes it a little bit easier for you to see the uh, the you know the messages if you're using a light colored wallpaper and to get rid of that backdrop hit escape and you can see it goes away so space for the backdrop or escape and uh, that'll get rid of that um, alt Y here's the hidden today preview so uh, let me go down to calendar there's the hidden today preview and again if you're using a uh, lighter colored wallpaper hit the space key and that's going to go ahead and uh, pop up the backdrop for you, so it's a little bit easier for you to uh, it's easier for you to see. Um, so there you have it. And what we'll do is we'll escape out of the backdrop, but we'll just leave that running. We can flip back into landscape mode. So here's landscape mode on the uh, torch with your own uh, wallpaper activated. Um, as you can see with the icon highlight, you can still see the icons fine, but yet they have a light backdrop, so it still kind of allows you to uh, to see your wallpaper. Um, so that's basically what you've got there. Flip back over, and now you've got your hidden today where you can you can do your thing there. Uh, moving the icons around. If you want to move any icons around, go into your main menu. Um, then hover the hover over top of the icon you want to move. Let's say phone. Okay, hit the menu button again, say move, and then you can move that into the position. It's now in slot two, so if I go back to the home screen, you can see it's now in slot two. Um, so that's how you move the icons around, and then if you flip over into uh, landscape mode, what you'll see here is in uh, slot two is your phone icon. Um, so that is how that works. Um, so that basically, that's going to sum it up. I'll turn this off. Uh, let me go back in and let me reset the wallpaper. So to reset the wallpaper, go menu button, then go down to options, then go into reset wallpaper. Yes. Escape end out of that, and it takes you back, and now the the black wallpaper set. Um, so that's it. So that's 6.1 demoed on the 9800 Torch. If you need to see this on any other devices, check out our videos. We've got them on a 9530 running OS 5, a 9700 OS 5, and a 9000 uh, OS 4.6. So thanks much for watching. Again, this is Todd at NiceBlackBerry.com, and we'll see you again soon.